The recipe we're going to make now for italiandiet.com is eggplant alla parmigiana. We need eggplant, tomatoes, salt, oregano, parmesan cheese, breadcrumbs and olive oil. Let me show you how to make your eggplant for the parmigiana. I sliced the eggplant and then I've grilled them like this. Here I have some more grilled. It's really easy and you can use any kind of vegetables to do this. And remember that on the site on italiandiet.com you will find also zucchini alla parmigiana which is a wonderful and nutritious recipe. Before starting to marinate your tomatoes, remember to turn on your oven to 300 degrees. Now, I'm going to get the tomato. I'm going to pour a couple of tomato, canned tomato. Nutritional properties of tomato is not represented by classical nutritional elements like proteins, fats and carbohydrates but from some special nutrients called carotenoids. The most important is lycopene, that is a substance very important for prevent cancer and cardiovascular disease. Lycopene is not destroyed by cooked and is present also in tomato sauce. And I'm going to marinate it with a little bit of salt and some oregano. I'm going to mix it and rest it there so they will get the, the, the taste of the oregano and the salt. Then I'm going to oil the casserole dish. So I'm going to spread the olive oil in the casserole dish. In this way your eggplant won't get stuck. And now that they're ready, I'm going to grab the eggplant and place it on the base of the casserole dish. Eggplant is a vegetable with a very low caloric content and it has a very big amount of water, about 92%. The eggplant has the property to be filled of oil, so it's better the grilled eggplant then fried eggplant. Then I'm going to get the tomato, pour it on top of the eggplant. A little bit of Parmesan cheese. The Parmesan cheese is one of the most important and famous Italian cheese. It has a very big amount of protein, but also of fat, about the 30-34%. For this reason, the Parmesan cheese is a very caloric cheese, but it has a very high content of calcium, about 1 gram of calcium for 100 of gram of product. And a little bit of breadcrumbs. And then I'm going to do a second layer. Eggplants. Tomato. Parmesan. And breadcrumbs. Third layer. Eggplant. Tomato. Parmesan, breadcrumbs, and now I'm going to put it into the oven for about 20 to 30 minutes. And here it is, your tasty and delicious eggplant alla parmigiana for italiandiet.com.